Welcome back to more Lord of the Rings Online. Back here in Osguruth, ready to turn in some quests before continuing along to the swamps to do even more quests. What do you need? Aye, these will do nicely. They will fill our stores in time and allow us to part with some of the meats we have treated and the furs will prove that we share a common enemy. We have prepared the offering already but needed to replenish our stock before moving forward. Might I take a moment of your time? We have salted meat and first collected from the wargs. We would like to offer these to the creatures in hopes that they are not hostile. I ask you to be cautious, because this could prove to be very dangerous. We do not know what the creatures are, but we know that they are not trolls. Search to the south of the Great East Road, south and a little eastwards here, near the Torn Stones. You should find a small encampment of the creatures there. Seek out their leader and offer him supplies on our behalf. Interesting, so we're going to make contact with some sort of tribe. Let's turn in more quests. How can I be of service? A fine collection, one that shall inspire the people assuredly. They will know that this foe can be brought low, and that you are the hero who has done so. The stretch of road will be somewhat safer, I think, and perhaps we can afford to send runners to Hun Hunulf and Gatorick Munts with supplies for trade. Your efforts inspire and assist us all, Kippen. What's your need? Though it will travel slowly, the news of your victory will spread, and the Eaglin will come to know you. I offer you my thanks for all that you have done, and hope that you will continue to aid us in the future. And, wow, just leveled up. I didn't know I was so close to leveling up. Level 30. It's a pretty big milestone. Exciting stuff. Greetings. We shall see if the orcs are able to rally behind another, or if they falter as we hope. Regardless, this has been a great victory. Your deeds will be recounted throughout the Eaglane, and you will be known to all. I offer you my gratitude, and the gratitude of my people. We wish to honor all that you have done for us, Gippen. As we would not have much to offer, I hope this will suffice. Okay, let me get rid of that. Destination even dim. I'll accept that one. Hal Gamgee, cousin of the esteemed Samwise Gamgee, has need of aid in the town of Oak Barton in the Shire, bordering the region of Lake Evendim. So Evendim is going to be in another season. Probably season... I don't know, it's going to be a while, honestly. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Let's talk to this guy. What do you need? You have our gratitude, friend. It pains many to know that the orcs have claimed the lives of many Eaglin who fought beside them. Who fought against them. We will breathe easier knowing that the winds will not carry the pestilence from the south. Okay. And let's see if there's anything else to turn in. It doesn't look like it. Looks like this guy has a quest for me, though. Would you do something for me? Death, pestilence, and terror stalk us, Kippen. Two have been dealt with thanks to your effort. The third still sears above with an ever watchful eye. It is the eyes that I want. I speak of the gore crows, the black birds with sharp beaks and piercing eyes. They are spies along the road east and west from this place and they are ever vigilant. Take their eyes, and they cannot see, and what they cannot see, they cannot spread to their masters, the orcs and half-breeds. Seek the gore crows along the Great East Road, and bring me their eyes to prove that the creatures will no longer speak of us to their fell masters. Would you do something for me? We had a pen of boars once, poached now by orcs and spiders in the west and south. Friedrich means to make peace, and ask such a meager price to find that peace. Our stores will not hold long, and we need meat and water soon, or we will face famine. In the east, north of the road, you will find Dol Vague and a small encampment of our people. Find a speak to Northrim at this camp and assist him with his tasks. We must be well prepared for the near future. Okay. So, looks like Friedrich has another quest for me. Let's go talk to him real quick. I'll take a moment of your time. A moment of your time, Kippen. But know that the task I will ask of you will take more than a moment and set you on a course for true danger. Some time back, before the darkness spread from the east to north, we witnessed the arrival of the dead at Nandelu. We have often stayed afar from that place, as something there always set unease upon us. Now though, the evil emanating spreads fear throughout our people. I dispatch one of our strongest kinswoman to watch the ruins. She is there now with her companion, 
who is there at the behest of Stanrick. Should you wish to aid us further, make your way to the ruin of Dolvague, east along the road and north to the highest hill and assist her. Okay. Now finally, let me do some tasks here. I think I have some tough sword sheaths. And I think I have some broken wooden spears as well. But I think I'm gonna have to repeat them real quick. Greetings. What do you need? Okay, let me do another batch of those so I can do all five. How can I be of service? What can I do for you? And let me do one more. Guess broken wooden spears. That's gonna be my five of the day. What can I do for you? Excellent. Task limit reached. New skirmish available. Excellent. So I think that's gonna be the uh, thievery of mischief. And what else? Yeah, thievery and mischief is now available. That's one that we did in the tutorial for skirmishes, so I might do that at some point. And looks like I have another warden quest, so I might do that. I don't know, in the near future, we'll see. We'll see. But for now, let me go do some quests. Let me take a look at my tracker here. Got the epic quest on here, and then lowlands. Let me do... Let me put all of those up. Kind of see what I can do. So let me go down here to this encampment and do that offering of peace. And let me kill some crows along the way. Nice. Expert hurler, new deed. Let's take a look at that. Strike with javelin skills, okay. So I guess those deeds open up once I hit level 30. Wow, I am. I am lagging. Okay. Gonna keep going south. There's, there's a little camp right there. Kind of interested to meet these creatures. They said they're kind of like giants or trolls, but they're kind of friendly. Take a look at them. Oh my god, I'm lagging. Sorry about the lag, guys. Nothing I can do except maybe edit it out if it gets really bad. Surprisingly, that time it was actually my router that screwed up, not the Locho servers, but that's okay, I'm back. And here are our friends here, the Earthkin. They're pretty cool, pretty terrifying. 86,000 morale, level 100. They're pretty cool though, I like these. No need to fear the Jorthkin. We only seek to live as we have for ages past. They seem nice. I like the chieftain here with his big horns. Do you come with peaceful words? What is this, little stranger? It smells of meat and furs. You say it is a gift for the Jorthkin? Kekonan accepts the gift, little one. Yet we cannot give anything in return. We cannot give help to others until we have no more troubles. We are chased from our home and we must find a place that is safe. What brings you to this place? We are pursued by our past from our home in the north and east. We fled as darkness rose around us and came here to find peace. But peace will not come to us, not while the enemy follows us south. We stay here now, away from the forest and bog, ever in the sun to shield ourselves from darkness. At night, the trolls will roam free. If we could confront the darkness and defeat it, we could, perhaps, make friends of others who wish not to succumb to the shadow of evil. If uh, you have helped the tribe who wishes our friendship, perhaps you would help the Jorthkin too. Would you fight the trolls for us, make them go away? They hide in the bog, far to the south and east of here, at a place that the elf folk call Harlog. You are very tiny, but you should be fine on your own. If you come to help, you are welcome here. We left our homes in the hills and stone caves of the north as the trolls stirred and took back the land. In our haste, we easily could have overlooked the leader of their tribe, but we were cautious enough to hear his name and see his look. He is large and thick at the legs, bearing the look of a warrior at the strength of many. He is called Galrip, and he is the leader of the trolls in Harlog. What a gift it would be to know that he is defeated. A gift worthy of lasting peace it would be, 
he will still wander through the swamps of the south. He will hide among the trees, and his brethren will be difficult to face. Do you come with peaceful words? In our home northward, we wrote histories upon stone. When the trolls came, we abandoned our home and writing, and now we have little of the memories of our ancestors. The trolls now sift through our old homes and steal that history. We would have no knowledge of why we know only that they now carry our histories upon them. Will you search them in the shade of the forest on the east edge of Harlog? Take back our past and return it to us? Will do. I mean, these guys look pretty strong. They're like level 100. All of them. I don't understand why they can't go do this themselves. But that's okay. I can go help out. I still need to kill some crows here. Need seven more. So let me just kill some, and then I'll make my way over to the swamp and kill some trolls. Sounds like a good time. Okay, that's five. Do see one up ahead. Two. Still trying to work on this critical strike deed. That's why I'm still using uh, this ambush attack. I know it's not very efficient, but there's a reason for my madness here. Got a new deed, Perseverance. Let me see. So it looks like I got a bunch of new class deeds over here, level 30. That I need to work on. I kind of like working on the class deeds when I'm working on slayer deeds for certain regions. That way I can use all the different attacks and do them that way. You know what I just thought about? I haven't updated my class points in a very long time. So let me take a look at that. Yeah, I only got two, so not that many. Let me keep working on bleed damage. We'll just do that for now. It's not that big of a deal. I'm overpowered anyways. Because of all that um, stat tomes that I got from the Lotro store. Alright, let me head down to the swamp. Need one more crow, and there he is. Okay, that's all of them. So let me go back here. Let me take some of these out. Let me see. Alright, I think I'm okay. I'll just do these quests here in the tracker. Then I'll kind of head back. This slayer deed for killing trolls here in the swamp is a little bit of a pain. But that's not something I have to worry about until the end of the season when I'm doing the deeds. I need to go find a leader. Looks like he's probably gonna be in there. Okay, so these guys have quite a bit of health. Two thousand or so. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to kill these guys. It's okay though, I got a little bit of patience here. Okay. So I'm gonna try to avoid these trolls while I look for the leader. Because I'm sure he's going to have plenty of trolls around him that I can't really avoid. There he is. Alright. He doesn't look any stronger than the regular trolls. Man, 
Man, he resisted my surety of death. That kind of sucks. Okay. He's about to go down here. Excellent. So let me try to kill a few more. And Surety of Death does put a bleed on enemies, so if I keep increasing my bleed damage with my skill points, it's also going to make me a little bit more effective since Surety of Death is my go-to gambit. It's pretty much the one I've been using non-stop. Just so effective, man. It does a ton of damage. Okay, let me kill this guy. And I think I'll be done here. After I kill this one, I can probably get out of here. Okay. I think I'm good to go. Let me head back to the camp. The Earthkin camp. And guy's already back to life. I wish I had that ability. I wish I could come back to life if I died. Some orcs down here too. This guy's pretty strong. Level 31. I don't know what he's doing down here. I also need to head to the swamp in the north and do quests there, but there's a little camp there with a big quest hub, so I kind of want to clear up all the other quests before heading up there. Okay, so I'm going to have to climb up here from the side because it's a big mountain in front of me. I didn't know there was a skirmish camp here. Where is it? Right there. Okay, interesting. Good to know. So now that I've kind of unlocked skirmishes, at the end of the seasons, I'll be doing all the skirmishes that are relevant for the region. For example, there's a skirmish here in the Lonelands called Standard Amon Sul, so I can do that one during this season as well. Okay, let's talk to our chieftain here. What brings you to this place? It is done then. While our homes are lost, the creatures responsible for our exile is no more. And we can find peace here in these lands. The wargs and orcs will prove more a nuisance than a danger. They are meager creatures compared to the mighty trolls. Greetings. Yes, Kippen. This is the history of my people written upon the stone. You have done a great service, and it is clear that the little folk to the north chose you well. There is little to offer you, but our thanks. I hope that is enough. Do you come with peaceful words? You are oppressed. You are, you are possessed of strength beyond what I believed of such little people. You have earned our trust and given us hope. We honor you, and we give you our thanks and more. If you come to help, you are welcome here. Kekonon will accept the offer from the tribe you help, these Eagling. You have shown the Jorthkin, Jorthkin, oh my god, Jorthkin, that there is strength in little people who dwell here. Return to your folk and tell them that they may come to us, and we will speak with them and be friends. Go to their rocks to the north and give them my word. Okay, perfect. So... Let me stop over at Oscurth real quick, and then I'll go do some other quests. Turn the sky. I need to do this one as well. But I've got a ton. This Oatmeal Problems one, I'm not going to be able to do for a while because it requires me to go to Evendim. And I don't want to do that until I actually hit that region. I like to keep things... 
dramatic, I guess. Don't like to spoil a region until I actually get there. But Even Dim is one of my favorite maps. It's really cool. I think you guys will enjoy that one when we get around to it. What do you need? You have proven a choice unmatched, Kippen. We have found new allies in this world and we'll work with them to form a bulwark against the evil creeping here. Now we can focus our attention towards the Red Swamp in the north. Excellent. And then we turn in this quest. Greetings. Dead, yes? No more will come from the spies down on us from above. Can we not find a bit of peace in that? I think that we shall. You have done a great service once again, Kippen. There's little else needed for us to become well prepared for what lay ahead. Okay, and I think that's all the quests here for now, so I can finally head on over to the Red Swamp. So let me go. Let's go that way. Let me add all of these to my tracker here. What is this right here? Supporting our scouts. Okay. I might actually go there first before I come here to the Red Swamp. Because there might be a little bit of a quest hub over there. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I see some ruins back there. But I think this is the last little region here in the Lonelands. There's going to be a ton of quests up there, as well as one of the instances for the Lonelands. And I think once I'm done with all of that, I'll be nearing the end of the Lonelands, which is exciting, because then I can move on to another region. Okay, and here we go. We got another little camp. What can I do for you? Stanrick is a good man and his words are true. We must prepare for the dark future ahead. As my companion Swendreda will tell you, the ruins of Nandelu have grown darker than ever we have seen. My task is mundane but necessary. We require water bladders and food as moving a large number of people from one location to another may take longer than we have to find new sources of fresh water and food. To make these bladders and feed our people, we will need a creature untouched by corruption. The boars in these eastern stretches will suffice. There are many boars east along the road, but a handful of burrows can be found where the hills rise on the north and south sides of the road. Might I take a moment of your time? Before you leave, Kippen, I would ask one small task left over from the last folks who stopped to aid us here. We have some bladders already cleaned and ready for water. I ask you to make your way along the Great East Road to the last bridge and fill the bladder with water from Mythenthil, the Horwell. The bridge has stood through many ages, and we have found that the water taken from the northern end of the bridge is best. Draw the water and then return to me. How can I be of service? Friedrich is a strong leader and wise. I have learned much just by watching the coming and goings within the ruins. I know there is wealth to be gained from within the places, from within that place as well. If you are here to help, then I will gratefully accept any help you offer. She has three quests here. Might I take a moment of your time? The Eagling has always kept their distance from Nandilu. The ruins have an ominous feel that cannot be avoided. Since coming to this location, I have fought against some of the creatures there, and fought that, and found that they carry treasures that will bring us much in the way of trade. While you are fighting against these foes, I would ask that you collect these items so that we may earn something from the aid you are providing. Might I take a moment of your time? Though I bear a great deal of pride, I can admit that I know fear and no greater fear has come over me as seeing the master of the ruins. It roams in Nendelu with a skeletal white at its side at all times and is itself a creature of extreme terror. Should you happen upon this creature, I would advise running. 
If you stay and fight and emerge victorious, tell me and I may offer you a reward. The master of the ruins wanders throughout the ruins and is never in one place too long. Ooh, the walking dead. Interesting. Let's I take a moment of your time. We know that there are a great number of dead within this place. We have learned of the foul beings from the stone speaker and our friend Radagast. We know that they are evil and that they hate all that live. I must ask that you make your way to the ruins and destroy the dead there, for they are a blight upon the lands and should be purged. You will find a great number of these creatures, some bloated, some barely sheathed in flesh, and others bereft of flesh within the borders of Nandelu. Banish them from the ruins and then return to me. Whew. Okay, so we got a ton of quests here. It's going to be exciting to do them, but I'm going to do them in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching this one. Be sure to like the video, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and see you next time.